Greetings, my friends. As a watchman, I hold myself accountable. I also hold all of you accountable as well. The Shemitah, as I've said all along, is a Jewish-only thing. It's an Old Testament thing dealing with the Jews. And, of course, anything Jewish still deals with the Jews right now because it's not the time when God's going to deal with the Jews. That time will be during the Tribulation and Great Tribulation, the 70th week of Daniel. Right now, we're in the age of Gentiles. God is dealing with Gentiles. America is the great whore of Babylon. America will be judged, is being judged right now, but will be judged totally by God in his time. It has nothing to do with Shemitah. That is Jewish only. You are either a Jew or a Gentile. You can't be both. It's impossible. All the Christians who bought into the Shemitah stuff and promulgated it all across the Internet, you owe an apology to Jesus Christ. You owe an apology to all the other people out there who listened to the tripe that you were out there peddling. And Jonathan Cain, or Khan, however you pronounce his name, I love him. He's one of God's chosen people. But the bottom line is he needs to have his books tailored towards the Jews, not the Gentiles, because the Gentiles have nothing to do with that. And I don't know what his motives are, but I think he should refund all the money to every Christian, Gentile Christian, who is foolish enough to buy his book to begin with. There are Jew Christians as well. And that's fine. But again, they, once they become a Christian, they fall under the Holy Bible, the New Testament, Jesus Christ, not the Shemitah. It's an Old Testament thing. And all of these so-called uh, Christians who are part of the Hebrew Roots cult, who say you have to uh, follow all of the Jewish feasts and customs or you go to hell, they say that God was married and had a daughter. They say that Jesus is the name of the devil. They say that if you don't use a certain name for God, you call God the devil. They say that the Sabbath is on a Saturday for Gentiles when it's actually on Sunday. The Bible proves that. I've got the proof. It goes on and on and on. The bottom line is this. We are in the age of the Gentiles. We have been since Jesus Christ died, was risen again, and went back to heaven. So we're in the age of the Gentiles. Gentiles act like Gentiles, and Jews will act like Jews until the tribulation when God shows them who Jesus is. And right now, as I said in the news, Millions of Jews, praise the Lord, are seeking out Jesus Christ right now in the New Testament. It's already begun. But right now, we're in the age of the Gentiles. So stop all the stuff, and I'm ready for apologies any second. But again, I won't hold my breath. If you've never been saved or you're backslidden, I've got a prayer in the comment section under the video title. Pray that prayer. Do those steps as soon as possible. No one's guaranteed any more time in their life. This kind of video, when I have to rebuke somebody or a group, I do it on this channel. My new channel is a Peaceful Oasis. It's not to be done there. Share this video and take care. Bye.